Welcome back to Let's Play Pajama Sam 1. We have three that choices like now. Darkness. Yes, that, that is looks darkness. Like darkness. That tree there with lights on it looks like darkness. Kid, learn to do stuff. <laughs> so, which way are we so, going first? I believe we're going to the boat dock first. You'll like this guy, man. He's oh, very God. Sick. Don't tell oh, me. No, the we're going to the mines. I'm sorry. Oh, we're going to the mines. The mines. The mines of. There's glory. a sock. And we're going to talk to. Just another guy. day above another lava. Sock. <laughs> we're going to talk to the cart. Minecart, why you no floating I'm lava? I'm Sam. I'm going to capture darkness and put him in a lunchbox. That's great. My name's Mud. Really? No, really? Not really? It's mud? Then why did you say it is? Look, well, I'm sorry, kid. I'm just real depressed is all. See, I, I used to roll all over the place on this here I used track. to roll all over the bitches. Up, down, sideways, loop the loop. Over her oh, curve, oh, under her curve. You should have seen that. Rust? Yeah. Rust. rust. Sarcastically. See, my wheels are rusty. Oh, that ain't rust. Stuck you just right rolled here over on this shit. spot. Can't move at all. Gee, that's too bad. Yeah, especially in summer when the pigeons come down here for some shade. Yeah, they come down here for shade. <laughs> mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah, sure. Now we go to the boat. Now we go to the boat place. Hopefully. Look at this guy. Yeah. Let's talk to him. He looks depressed. <laughs> he is. Hi! Hello. My name's Sam. I'm going to capture darkness and put him in a metal lunchbox. After I find my lunchbox, I mean. Well, pleased to meet you, Sam. You can call me Otto. Have you seen my signature edition All Metal Pajama Man lunchbox? Um, no. Well, oh, that was heartless. <laughs> Would you give me a ride across the river? Oh, no. I can't go in the water. I'd sink. I mean, <laughs> wood, you know. But wood floats. No, I don't think so. I had this friend and he told me this story about his dentist brother who, um, he was made of wood and he got in the water Even the kids can't sank. believe this shit. Really? <laughs> Straight to the bottom, it's so scary. I wish I'd been a car. <laughs> I wish I'd been a car, then I'd be wood able to float. floats in the water. <laughs> oh, I wish that were true. Because metal floats, you know. All them tubes and stuff. So we use the plank of wood on the water. To smack him in the face. Oh, just show him it's close. Okay, check this out. It's wood, right? Yes. No. All right. It just whips watch. out his wood on both. See? It floats. Wood floats. Yeah? So you'll float too. Go on, give it a try. I guess. Well, so far, so good. <laughs> yeah, because that's well, floating. Well, here goes nothing. Ta-da! I'm doing it! I'm floating! Yahoo! Oh, then he realizes his entire Can life is going to be in that one on, lake. In. <laughs> you can't pick up the board now, it's useless. Like we needed to pick it up in the first place? Let's go sailing! Well, technically, we can't do that since I'm not a sailboat because I don't have a sail. Oh, I oh, know what look, you look mean, at the friggin' grammar, You <laughs> should say, let's go floating or something like or that. Or friggin' sure, English sure, teacher. Whatever you say. Let's go sailing. Okay. And then sing. Because that makes sense. So let's go across. Is there anywhere else you could have gone? Mm hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Bye, Otto. I'll be back soon. Okay, I'll wait here. Even if I wasn't, it's not like you're going anywhere. <laughs> that happens. Another sock. Got another sock. So basically, 
you gotta find the sock. Mm -hmm. And these guys are just jerks. Hi, my name's Sam. How nice. I'm going to capture darkness and put him in my lunchbox. Yes, well, why don't you run along and play then? We have important tree business to discuss. Tree business? Hold. Just where do you think you're going? Um, nowhere really. I just wanted to pass by. Just barging through like that. Without even you're a tree! What the hell are you UK? <laughs> it is customary. Oh no, this isn't another customs inspection, is it? Are you gonna take all my stuff? I assure you, we have no interest in your stuff. Because you're poor. Phew, that's a relief. I'm sorry if I... Unless you want to give us those through? delicious no. butt flat no. pajamas. <laughs> this is an exclusive road. It's for trees only. Yes. Trees only. Now, be off with you. Trees only. Hey kid, guess what? They're trees, just walk by them. <laughs> So now we have to go back, and obviously the right thing to do is stick your head in the log. That was a log Maybe that looked more, more like some type of log. creature. Maybe there's a frog in it or something. Rats, there's nothing in here at all. Uh oh, I think I'm stuck. <laughs> yes, I'm definitely Well that doesn't sound kid friendly. I wonder how Pajama Man would handle this. It'll just fall off. Don't click anything. Phew, it's hot in there. So oh, just that was random. <laughs> just does it again. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh. Looks so zany. Wow. Whoops. So is is the kid like not understanding what's going on? Uh, tree coming through. Nope. Good day to you, fellow tree. Yes. You like this next character? That tree looks smashing with those butt flap pajamas. <laughs> Hot in there. Hey, that's my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox over there. I can't get to it through all these plants with big thorns on them. I wish I had super tough Vines. skin like Pajama Man. So what do we do? We click on the camera. This guy's awesome. Is that my Pajama Sam mask? This mask belongs to the people. It sure looks like my mask. Property is theft, man. Anyway, I need the mask to protect my identity as the leader of the Salad Liberation Front. The what? The Salad Liberation Front. We're a group of veggies fighting against the core system. We're tired of being relegated to the salad. We want to be the main course. Whatever. I just want my mask back. I'll tell you what. The other carrots are being held prisoner in the refrigerator in darkness is <laughs> If you help me free the carrots, I'll give you back the mask. I'm sorry, okay, but I couldn't take this character seriously as soon as I saw you had a beard. I'll come with you to the kitchen so I can direct you. <laughs> okay, sure. Yeah, just uh, get my butt flat there. It's just uh, nice and warm. There'll be a nice little crevice you can... Uh, I get into there. Put my ingenious disguise back on. Whoa! Good fortune to you. Thank you, fellow tree. <laughs> because it's fantasy, so people are stupid. Has all the grace of slipping on a banana peel. <laughs> so now we. Thanks for the lift, Otto. We go to the refrigerator to free the other carrots. 
free the other Karens. <gasps> yep, this is Darkness's house, all right. This has darkness all over it. Just look at those lit up windows. I wonder how it got here. Colorful, this colorful house in a tree that just spells darkness. Oh. Yeah, we don't want to do the rocks yet. These are pretty heavy. Those are <laughs> pretty heavy. There's no mail. Beat it. <laughs> Keep checking. Well, Is right, it wrong that you mail, sound just like darkness. my mailman? And it's all bills. <laughs> you don't want what's in here. Trust me. The last guy who wanted in here didn't leave here alive. Oh, all right. Here you go. Darkness may already have won a fabulous million dollar prize. Yeah, right. <laughs> that was a weird Easter egg. So that was Pajama Sam. During our next part, we'll get to see the boat more and the carrot and I have a sneaking feeling that we're gonna see a giant bird eating some type of fruit I'm not calling it or spoiling anything but I have a hunch 